happy day five to me. I just returned from my first appointment. It's the first tracking of the IVF process that I've done, that I've had. And in that appointment, I get a baseline blood and a test, and I also get a uh, sonogram, ultrasound. And what they're doing is they're looking for my ovaries, which are plumping up and looking really nice. They found three follicles, possibly four, uh, and my estrogen level is okay. I kind of overdid it on the Dell estrogen last night, and I am okay. Uh, they said sometimes it happens, people take it every day instead of every third day, but uh, for now I'm done with Dell Estrogen. The overdose is not a problem. If anything, she says my estrogen levels are going to be on high, on swole, so not an issue. I am just about late for my Cetrotide, and um, all of my prescriptions will remain the same, and today they are adding Minopur. And uh, Minopure is, um, I've been heard, I've heard it's been called the miracle uh, injection. So I uh, can't quote exactly what it does right now. I'll think about that and I'll come back later and talk about that. So um, my dosages have dropped a little bit today, at least one of them. But I'm um, going to receive my new protocol uh, in the patient portal shortly with um, the updates on what I'm supposed to do. But um, I go back on Friday. She said she wants to see me back on Friday for the uh, next tracking. So I love my endocrinologist. She is just so cool. Um, everyone loved that I had my charges with me. Um, they know that I'm a nanny. <laughs> so they embrace the kids when I have to bring them. My clients are so supportive. They know that uh, I have to do these appointments back to back to back to back now. So they are all game and they are completely cool with me taking the kids with them versus just taking off work to do these appointments. So that makes no sense. So this is a brand new box. So I have to mix the powder again with the uh, solution that comes with it. So I'm gonna pop the cap off. Um, ah, there we go, alcohol swab. They were very impressed when I shared with them that I um, was tracking this on uh, line and that I started um, a YouTube channel to um, track my progress along this this journey and um, they are so supportive of it that they're going to follow me and they are going to give me credits for every subscription and those credits will go towards my account and it can be used towards my fertility and IVF treatments so Chipmunk and I are asking for your support. We're asking you to follow us and we're asking you to subscribe. Please subscribe. It will tremendously mean so much to me that you guys maintain an interest in just following along with my journey. And um, this is just my real experience and it's turned out to be so therapeutic for me and I don't feel so much as if I'm alone or by myself doing this. Um, some people are very taken aback <laughs> that I um, have chosen to be public with this. Um, some people are very critical that I've chosen to go public with this, but I ain't got time for that. <laughs> I mean, it is what it is, you know. Um, I'm not one for putting you know, a lot of my business out there and then regretting it later and like, oh God, I shouldn't have said that, you know, but <sighs> secrets have never benefited me, ever. And um, there is a such thing as, you know, keeping certain things to yourself, absolutely, absolutely. 
but um, 